Hello, humans and pets. Ooh. Just gonna chill. <laughs> it's so cold. It is. Um, it's freezing. So we're gonna be eating hot sauce today. What is this? This is Tapatio. This actually, the first time I've had this, Ryan hasn't had this. I've never had this in my life. Uh, he, he has. First time I had it, we were in Hawaii and I bought it because it was. I was like, oh, that looks different. And, and I had no idea. And then it steadily became like one of my favorite hot sauces after that. Like, I never seen it again. Like, yeah. I, I was like, wow, that's really good. Then I didn't see it for the longest time. And then one of the Mexican uh, restaurants that we go to actually had it on the table. So I had it again there, and then I happened to find it at Walmart. So here we are. Somebody suggested it, so we're going to be doing it today. Correct. Someone did suggest it. And it's, a, it's actually what I remember of it. I haven't had this one in a while, so I'm kind of excited to try it again. Uh, someone had told me they suggested something else that I had bought a bunch I of. I did not. That's and the then, So I bought a bunch of that hot sauce. And so when you have a different hot sauce to review... But that'll be for a later date, I, I guess. I promise I don't. But we do but, have like eight different flavors. So yeah. Like, now, see, smell it. it. To me, it's just, it. It's I, I absolutely love this one. I hate the cut at the top, though, I'm going to tell you. That, oh, is right? the bottle not fun? Yeah. Oh. I'm going to I'm gonna have to get rid of that right off the bat. That makes it a lot less enjoyable. Yeah, see, that's just delicious. It smells good. Mm. So, <laughs> so it's not... To me, it's an average spice. It's it's not um, really hot, mm -hmm. but it's hotter to me than like a Frank's or Louisiana hot sauce. Um, what do you think? It, it has that, but the flavor in there it is is really good. Um, it, it's got like a sweetness in there, but there's also the heat. I I love. I actually really like this one. It reminds me a lot of um the sweet chill one we tried. We had to poke the top. Yes. It reminds me of that and like a mix of Cholula. Um, because that's like another hot sauce that I like. Mm -hmm. I like it a lot. Um, does it have more like heat than like Frank's Red Hot? I think so. Yeah. It has like that Mexican, the, the, like something you want to put in a chili or you want to put on beef. Like to me, like, like that's what Cholula reminds me of. It has that flavor, but it has a little more heat than what Cholula doesn't yeah. usually have heat. Cholula doesn't normally have any heat. Okay, man. Mm -hmm. See, to me, I think the guy or the girl, I don't remember who actually, uh, suggested this one recommended it with like fish or something i think this goes on everything like this to me has i actually think it has more in-depth flavor than even like a franks or a louisiana like i think it just i like it better yeah there's more going on and again the first time i ever tried it it was on like a whim i didn't think i was gonna even like it and then i was like oh i think i really like this one because I've, I've put this on i always Attributed to like hard boiled eggs, like some things you don't want on a hard boiled egg, but this to me, I, I, I can put this on anything. I absolutely love this one. I do like it a lot. Um, where would you put this in like a ranking list? And now, heat wise, it does kind of grow a little bit, like it has a yeah. decent heat, it's not. It's not crazy, mm -mm. but and that was what I was going to ask you. What do you want? How? how what? What do you ask me to rank? Like, like compared to the other sauces we've had on the channel, where do you think it sits? Heat wise or taste wise? Whatever. Um, heat wise, I think it's in the middle, the middle of the road. It, it's, it's, it's. Mm -hmm. Well, how to say with the Tabascos, because we had that one Tabasco that was crazy hot. But yeah, it's hotter than the regular Tabasco, mm -hmm. but not as hot to me as like El Yucateco was. I think that one has a little more heat than, than this does.
flavor wise though it's right up there with with uh like I really like the taste of El Yucateco and I really like the taste of that garlic Melinda's. The I think my, the garlic and I, I think those are my two favorite flavors. I agree. This is right there though. Because it's not only yeah. a nice spice. To, <clears throat> that one just hit me in the back of the throat. To me, it it is you know, salsa picante. It it really is like a salsa to me. Like this is mm -hmm. Perfect te territory if I'm going to have tacos. or if, You know what I mean? It's perfect for any Everything. of that. Yeah, it really um, is. I think the flavor is really good. Um, hmm. I don't know where I'd put it. That's what I'm trying to figure out. Is I don't know where I would stick it. I don't, if, if I'm going just taste, I, I put it right up there with uh, probably one of the better tasting ones. It, it's definitely top two or three. The only one that I can remember, and, and I don't really remember it, to be honest with you, is, uh, I'm going to keep eating it. I'm starving. Red Deal uh, Active Lizard? No, that one I didn't like because it was mm -hmm. it was very salty to me. I think it's around that same heat, though. It, it might be heat-wise. Flavor-wise, <laughs> though, I'm going to say it might be the best one we've had as far Ooh. as, but I really like, I really like that Melinda's. To me, I really that like had a Melinda's. deep... Deep, it, that, that was actually the perfect hot sauce because it had a lot of flavor, but it had a generous amount of heat, too. You know what I mean? It wasn't yeah. overly hot. It gave you that appearance like it was going to be Plus super hot. Plus, garlic in hot sauce is good. Mm -hmm. um, I like it. So, mm. I put it right around one of the best. No, I, I definitely... I, I, I get up there. Yeah, oh no, that is definitely... Out of all the Melinda's, the best thing about that one... That one yeah. Was that I put the other really hot one in it. Yeah. So I had that good flavor with the good heat. But this is definitely right up there with uh, like top two on, on, on my list of ones that we've done. So the one thing I dislike about it is the bottle. I hate the um, bottle. I, 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 but on it doesn't a, pour too well. On a good note, uh, to me it's not super hot. So I'll take that, I'm going to take that cover right off. Yeah. And then you can just pour it. Um, I like it. Yeah, so definitely, if you haven't tried this, good suggestion. Uh, I don't know if Ryan's going to pin whoever suggested this, or and if he even remembers which yeah, I'll be, I'll be one of the it. ones that we, we, we reviewed. But uh, if you haven't seen it, it's, it's everywhere. Yeah. I don't know when it came everywhere, but I, I found it in Walmart uh, a while back. So if it's there, it's usually everywhere. Definitely, if you haven't tried this one, grab it. It it it's more of a salsa than a hot sauce to me, but it's got a heat. Yeah. It's got a heat, but it tastes like you're eating like a salsa type. I mean, I could just drink it, mm -hmm. um, which is a good thing. Mm -hmm. There you go. So, Tapatio, go give it a try. I, I two two huge thumbs up on this one. I this is again. I was kind of I was happy to hear. When when someone suggested this one because I I personally love it anyway so yeah there you go so there is our tapatio review uh, leave a comment down below if you've tried it whether you like it you don't like it and uh, hit that subscribe button yeah and hope you enjoyed the video.